welcome to JSA TV, the newsroom for tech and telecom professionals. I'm Jamie Scott Okataya. Here at beautiful Honolulu, take a look at this video footage shot from a drone care of Excite Modular. Really beautiful shot of PTC 2019. Joining me here today, my good friend, Mr. Nick Linosi. He is the COO of Resurgence Infrastructure Group, or Resurgence IG. Nick, welcome to JSA TV. Well, thank you. I appreciate the opportunity to speak with you a little bit today and uh, let you know a little bit about uh, Resurgence and what we're up to. Yeah, we're so excited to have you uh, here on JSA TV. Nick, it's been uh, so many wonderful years that I've, I've had the opportunity to know you. And uh, I, so a lot of great expertise you bring into this, uh, this company. It's a new name for folks here, Resurgence IG, but some great assets. Uh, tell us about them. Yes, yeah, so we, um, we currently own and operate 736 miles of fiber network from Atlanta, Georgia, um, down to Miami via Jacksonville. And so um, today we, um, we primarily are a dark fiber provider. Um, with a fully 100% underground network. And um, because of the location of the fiber, it's, uh, it's been very important for a lot of the subsea guys who come into Florida. So it's a, a great asset and uh, we have plenty of capacity. And uh, we're just trying to uh, you know, make it uh, a little bit more valuable than it was in the past. And here we are, January 2019. What are your expansion plans for this year? So the expansion, um, what, we're, what we're really trying to do is to uh, take some off-ramps uh, off of our, our existing network. And so uh, today we've primarily just pretty much serviced each end of the uh, spectrum of Atlanta and Miami, as well as Jacksonville. And so, you know, a lot of the opportunities for fiber expansion come into the metro. Um, and, and whether that's data center, enterprise, government, you know, municipalities, um, the off-ramps are really very important. And it's something that hasn't been done with this asset in the past. And so that's the primary expansion driver for 2019, is to get some off-ramps. I love that, off-ramps. Also, you know, this fiber, very unique. You're sitting on some pretty great assets there. Underground, as you mentioned, what other key differentiators should we talk about when we talk about your fiber assets? Yeah, so, you know, in this, um, there's always competition, right? And so there is existing fiber, um, you know, in similar arenas between Jacksonville and Atlanta and Atlanta to Miami. However, um, the existing fiber is much older. Mm -hmm. So it was deployed either in the 90s um, or even earlier for some of the carriers. And so this fiber was actually built and deployed in 2015 and 2016. And, uh, you know, a lot of a lot of the uh, carriers and enterprise players who are looking for dark fiber services want to be assured that their network um, is got the latest and greatest kind of abilities and so you know not that fiber won't last 30 or 40 years but you know the fact that the existing fiber uh, that might traverse maybe not on the same route but traverse between the cities is much older in nature and so the fact that this is really three and four year old fiber is really a big differentiator it truly is and for those who might not already know this answer why dark fiber and mm -hmm. why now so, you know, dark fiber truly um, has been around for a while and, um, you know, many of the, uh, the carriers and uh, enterprise players have always, you know, looked at dark fiber but have, you know, pr pretty much had to go the traditional route with, you know, uh, managed lit services and, and those are still important for most. But, um, you know, the larger players want to own and operate their own networks. Yeah. And uh, so it's not enough for them to, you know, even with the bandwidth increases to just continue to buy lit services when, you know, the opportunity is there to, to buy fiber that they can own and control. Yeah, it's all about control these days. Yeah. So where can our viewers go if they want to learn more? So um, personally, you know, we've uh, spent a lot of time and energy, uh, you know, building our, our website and our brand. So uh, www.resurgenceig.com or, you know, 
clearly, hopefully, they can reach out to me directly, you know, and it's, it's on the website as well, but we'd love to talk to them about, you know, the opportunities, and we're not really just limited to that Atlanta to Miami. We're always open, you know, we, uh, we have the ability to expand and increase our coverage outside of that area. And, uh, and that's what we hope to do here in 2019 as well as 2020 is, you know, make this more viable a network so that we can scale it to multiple markets. And Nick, I have to say personally, knowing you from Looking Glass days, Bright House days, you're an expert in our industry. We're so excited to see what you do uh, with Resurgence IG. And thank you so much for joining us. Well, I appreciate the opportunity again. And, and, and I'm not an expert, just somebody who's been around it way too long. An expert in, in my view, yes. But <laughs> thank, you. thank you guys for, for tuning in here to JSA TV. Happy networking.